Hi right, guys, welcome to week 20 of our Persia Road project. So this is the five bed luxury HMO that we're doing. Um, so this week I think half of the kitchen has gone in, half of the ensuites have gone in. It actually look really nice. So a special thanks to Daniel Kennedy for that one. Uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, and also we've uh, sort of passed boarded the uh, tank area as well. Okay, so same again, uh, actually walk you around uh, and talk you through it. One second. Let's do it. Cheers, mate. So it's going to be a super quick one today. So let's go. So as two mentioned, um, plasterboard in this area here. Obviously, this will also be blocked off. Um, if you just pop in there, you can see. More importantly, fireboarded. Um, obviously, under here was fireboarded anyway. Uh, that will just need a bit of paint, which has also been fireboarded. So at least we know in terms of the tank, um, a lot of the boiler operations in here and the plumbing, it is all fully secure. Okay. Um, I'll tell you what, not much progress in, in, in the room in terms of the actual room. Like two mentioned, all the ensuites have been put in apart from the toilet. So we won't try and step over there, we just walk into this room. So this is one of our um, larger, more brighter rooms. So if you can pop in there too, you can see. So flooring is in, wash basins in, tower radiator is in. We have got um, most of the showers in, but you can see the aqua boards looking really nice. And we think it's a nice contrast. So yeah, yeah. coming in and actually seeing it, um, initially we thought that the, the aqua boards may be slightly too dark, but it works well, obviously with the white walls, with the chrome, and especially the flooring, which is, yeah. gives a kind of good accent to it all. We'll have a closer look upstairs, where the uh, answer is a bit larger. So, into the kitchen dining area, and you will see that we have already started in earnest um, putting together the kitchen units. So, all kitchen units, you can see we've got a nice fancy um, extractor fan there. So, cooker's going to be housed in this area, the sink is going to be housed in and around here. We've obviously got our boiler which has already been installed, and we're still toying with a few ideas. So. You would have seen a couple of weeks ago we decided that we we're going to go with a breakfast bar sort of coming where we were talking about to round about here yeah just under the yeah. round about here um so two just asked the question he wants to put something maybe a little bit more rustic in so we're thinking about it um i didn't like the idea but... <laughs> i just realized it's what it's white counters we're going for isn't it yes we'll yeah. see some over there so that'll yeah. be quite nice shall we go over there yeah. shall we wait until next week to show them when it's uh... on yeah, I'll put it on, wait yeah? for it. Okay, yeah. so there, there are worktops there, and um, that's the back, so wait until you see the front of them. Again, nice nice big corner, corner shower unit, and it works really well. So I think for, throughout most of the house too, we're going to be going with the sort of white with the grey accent. Yeah. Most of the flooring uh, is going to be sort of that dark. Oh, um, Michael suggested tiles for the entrance downstairs and the uh, bathroom, oh, sorry, the kitchen. Yeah. Um, similar to another one. I think he said it's the same price as uh, vinyls. Yeah. Well, so similar, that's to, good. similar to Willow. Um, yeah. In yeah. Willow, we, we had a nice, sort of really nice hardware in vinyl. Yeah, um, but he's gonna, we're gonna try uh, tiles. Perfect. Yeah. Tiles instead. Yeah, he's perfect. gonna have a look at it. Um, again, same in this room. We, we're not far off now. Uh, obviously, we've got the radiators are all in. Bathrooms are near enough finished. These rooms upstairs have been close to being done for a little while. And I think if we look at bedroom number five, which is our largest bedroom, I think you get a good look at the shower rooms there, the ensuite. So looking really nice. And I think, to be fair, all the, all the colours work well because this is a bit of a lighter grey. Yeah. So it all works well. I mean, if you look down and on the tiles, you've got the lighter grey on the inside, the darker grey on the outside, and obviously the white. And then even in here is a different shade of grey. And on the floor tiles, everything works with yeah. everything in the room. I might try and get some of this colour next time. <laughs> the actual blue that we... Well, I can't yeah. afford. <laughs> that, that last time, I actually wouldn't mind. Yeah, so all good. Um, second fix electric, electrics will happen. The bathrooms will, the ensuites will obviously be finished up. And then the kitchen will be finished up. And then we're just looking at flooring and then door furniture and, and a few final bits. I think this has had another another coat of paint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh yeah, okay. Yeah, this one's had another coat of paint, yeah. Yeah, because it looks 
pretty glossy. It does. It's nice. Nice and really spacious. <laughs> cool. All right. See you guys next week. Bye.